Days of Our Lives, DOL. Spoilers recap for Tuesday, July 11, reveals that Rafe Hernandez, Galen Jaring, scolded Gaby Hernandez, Camila Banas, at the hospital before Stephen Demera, Brandon Barash, came along and put her on full blast. Stefan was furious with Gabby for lying to him and putting herself in harm's way by confronting Megan Demera, Miranda Wilson, so they argued before patching things up at home later. Gabby and Stefan made a pact to be a team from now on, so that meant no more going rogue alone. Meanwhile, Harris Michaels, Steve Burton, was frustrated over the lack of progress in repeated hypnosis attempts with Marlena Evans, Deidre Hall. Although Harris just wanted to get zapped like before, Marlena insisted no one was getting zapped on her watch. Marlena pointed out that Harris programming wasn't as ingrained this time around, so she thought they should try other methods first. Harris finally had a breakthrough when he remembered Dr. Wilhelm Rolf, Richard Wharton, tricked him into believing Lai Shin, Remington Hoffman, had delivered the order to eliminate Stefan. On Tuesday's Day's episode, Marlena showed Harris a picture of Stefan on her phone and confirmed that he no longer had a desire to go after him. Down on the pier, Dia and Melinda Trask, Tina Huang, grew frustrated with Sean Brady, Brandon Beamer, for calling off the diver search for Megan and Dr. Rolf. Sean argued that the submarine was obviously long gone, so he didn't see the point of having the divers keep looking. When Trask smelled alcohol on Sean's breath, he denied it. Sean insisted that the nearby booze bottle didn't belong to him either, but Trask threatened to have it dusted for Prince and eventually pried a confession out of him. Although Sean didn't think it was a big deal, Trask disagreed and wound up calling for Sean's firing back at the station. Rafe insisted this was his department and made it clear that Trask needed to back off. Soon after on Tuesday's Day's episode, Rafe got updates from Marlena about Harris' memories under hypnosis, so he learned Megan and Dr. Rolf had set Lie up to take the fall. Back at the hospital, Harris couldn't confirm that Lai wasn't involved, but he did point out that he never saw Lai at the lab. Since Marlena was willing to vouch for Harris and no longer considered him a threat, Rafe agreed to take the handcuffs off Harris and let him go. However, Harris later had a favor to ask and surprised Marlena by pushing her to have him committed to Bayview. At the Dimura Mansion again on Tuesday's Day's episode, Gabe got a call from Rafe with the news about Lai being framed. Since Gabe still couldn't shake the feeling that Lai was caught up in all this somehow, she feared Lai could still go after Stefan. Gabby and Stefan stuck to their pact to be a team, so they vowed to handle Lee together. In the Salem PD interrogation room, Wendy Shin, Victoria Grace, ripped into Lay for refusing to let Gaby go and scheming in such a horrific way. Although Wendy was ashamed of her brother, Lee protested that he was innocent and didn't think Wendy was in any position to judge him for not moving on. After Lee pointed out that Wendy had been stringing along two poor saps for months, Wendy insisted that wasn't the same thing. Lee eventually offered some advice since he thought Wendy had a big heart and knew her choice deep down. Trask also spoke to in the interrogation room, where he was smug about her having to let him walk free. Although it had slipped through Trask's fingers twice now, she warned that he wouldn't be so lucky next time. Days of Our Lives spoilers say Lai has some shockers in his future, so stay tuned. CDL will have other fantastic Days of Our Lives spoilers, updates and news to read up on so make us your favorite DOL hotspot.